Hey folks, Ian Robson here with the Fishing Experiment. Today is April 23rd, 2017. We're down by Nows Lake here. Now we're going to see if we can't catch some fish. I've been told there are some fish active now in this area, so I'm going to give it a go and see how it works. It's, I'm going to try a snelled hook setup. Same one I was trying last time, I didn't catch any fish on it. No luck yet so far. We've got a couple different locations. We're going to give this a, a go down here and see how it goes. Um, seeing a few guys pull some fish out, so I know there are some fish in here still uh, but this is the location I was uh, suggested so uh, let's see if we can't catch some fish over here oh folks what we got here a monster crappie holy cow look at this folks this is just a monster crappie look at the size of that slab holy smokes folks Nice little crappie, just really in nice and slow. That is a gorgeous looking crappie. Look at that, folks. Let's get a quick picture of that real quick. Wow. First legit fish, 2017 for me. Crappie are in season all year here in my zone. But that is a just a gorgeous looking crappie. Look at that, wow. There you go, folks. Look at that, gorgeous crappie. Let's put it back here. He's ready to go already. There he goes. Gorgeous, gorgeous looking crappy. Nice. See if we can't get another, folks. I have six pound cast king fluoro coat on here. Works really nicely here. Using my medium light, I think it's medium, medium light rod. Just works perfect for this scenario. I could probably use my ultra light too, but this just seemed to work a little bit better. I wasn't sure if I was going to go for some. Uh, carp today so I brought the medium instead of the ultralight but both would work. You can see that folks over there? That was a carp jumping out of the water. I don't know what it was doing there but that's what it was. Fortunately I'm not uh, now I'm not set up for carp here anymore. I was before with my other setup but I don't know I've never tried to catch carp on six pound test so that would be kind of interesting. I'm sure it's possible. I'm just not skilled enough I don't think for that. So what I'm, letting do, what I'm letting this do is just sink really slow. I'm using a 164th ounce jig head. Just letting it slow. It's got a little um, uh, creature bait on there. And just jigging it along the bottom real slow. This guy's like dancing here. You guys can see that or not. But there's a fish just doing a little dance in front of us. I think it's a mating dance or he's trying to feed on something. We're not sure, but it's fun to watch regardless. That's a bullhead. Oh, that's a bullhead. All right, folks, just got another fish here. This time it's a bullhead. Whoa. Six pound test. This should be kind of interesting. Casking fluoro coat. No problem. There you go, folks. Nice little bullhead here. Got to be careful about that. There you go, folks. Nice little bullhead. Nice little bullhead, folks. Got the hook out right in the top lip, actually. There you go, folks. All right, folks, let's put it back. All right, folks, we got that one nice crappie there. Didn't catch anything else. Still a little cold for me. Uh, it's still cold for the fish, I guess. Uh, and hopefully the audio is good for this, but we're going to see if we can't catch some, uh, some more fish soon. Um, I had good luck in this little corner over here, and apparently there's some other areas you can get some still, but we'll see what happens, and uh, thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. My name is Ian Robson from The Fishing Experiment, and I'll catch you guys later.